Hello viewers, today we're on the High Street and we're in Elgin up in the north of Scotland. You can see just at the top of the High Street or the bottom, depending on where you think it comes from. The train station around the corner, We've got a signpost to Perth and Inverness, are not too far away. We're going to take a wee walk down the High Street and just show you what shops, bars, and restaurants have got open in Elgin. So Elgin, we're about 10 minutes away from Lossiemouth. That's where I'm staying tonight. Let's take a wee walk down the high street. I've been further down here, there's a wee bit of building work going on, so it might get noisy later on. So of course we've got the fish and chip shop there. Every high street needs a fish and chip shop. Marks and Spencer's food hall. They do good food, Marks and Spencer's, don't they? It's not the cheapest, but it's good quality. The Indians have just passed there. The Victoria Bar on the left hand side. Local butchers here. Cash machine if you need any money out next to the Victoria at the Royal Bank of Scotland. Badenox drinks and street food in there. It's quite nice inside. The vape shop, you see them everywhere now, don't you? Z bar across the road, I think it's open just now, unfortunately. It's actually quite a long high street for being such a wee small place, Elgin. It's got quite a long high street. As we get further down, we'll come to some of the big brand shops that you recognise. Give me a comment that you've been in here before. The White Horse Inn. Let me know you're from Elgin, maybe you've moved away, you're staying somewhere else, give me a comment. Scribbles restaurant here. Another fish and chip shop. And a couple of nice buildings right in the centre of the high street. This wee bakery at Asher's, I've got one in Lossy Mouth as well, looks quite nice. <laughs> so they're doing quite a bit of building work here, I think they're building some things. Some new shops are becoming, a couple of these side streets. Samuel Jewellers, Hall in the Barrett, Health Shop. Buttons unfortunately went bust. Hopefully we'll get replaced soon by another shop. Some nice buildings here. You can trespass at outdoor shop because we're quite close to Aviemore and the Cairngorms National Park, so there's a lot of people come up here. Check this guy out. The dandelion. Found in the River Loss in 1797. Mm, information there on the dandelion. So that's the Church of Scotland building with the big pillars. It's a really nice building, it's quite unusual but to have a church. The building in the middle of the high street, isn't it? It's quite unusual. Got a wee bit 
of information on Elgin here. Some old pictures. Quite interesting. Pause the video if you want to read about that. Increase the size if you want to see the text. Emincos over there. And here we've got the War Memorial. So that War Memorial in the middle is for the Great War. First World War. And then down in the left and the right, we've also got some plaques for the Second World War. So this will be people who unfortunately passed away in this area during the wars. Again, if you're from this area, maybe you've got family, pause the video, check out the names. Maybe you'll recognise somebody. Coffee lovers, don't worry, you've got Starbucks here on the left hand side, it's quite a nice building it's in as well. Across here, you've got a pancake place, you've got boots. As I say, this is Church of Scotland building, one of the pillars, it's a really nice building. Got some building work going on over there, so we'll go, we'll go down this side. Pancake place. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name's Kevin. I do a lot of walks, mostly around Scotland. So if you're interested in that sort of thing, it's your lucky day. You can subscribe absolutely free. Just click the wee red button below the video. Say subscribe. And hit the wee bell next to it for all notifications. So that basically means you get a wee message from YouTube and upload a new video. How exciting! There's the St Giles Centre, I'll do another video just walking through there, it's like an older shopping centre, it's got some shops and a food court down the bottom, but it's not got that many big shops in it really, to be honest with you. Quite a few of them are shut, unfortunately. There's another nice wee monument there. You muckle. A few nice buildings in the high street in Elgin. It's got some character. The shortbread shop, Walker Shortbread. Now, in the height of tourist season with international visitors, I'm sure that shop does quite well. I'm not so sure in the current situation how it's doing. Santander Bank. We've always got a Costa, haven't we? So we've got Starbucks further up, we've got Costa here. Who do you prefer, Starbucks or Costa? There's always a Costa, isn't there, in the high street? A couple of wee side streets in Elgin as well with shops in them. I'll maybe do another video going up and down a couple of them. Car parking's quite difficult in the centre of Elgin because it's not a big place, but just round the corner to the left here, you've got a car park, uh, about 85 spaces. Then the keys cut, you got in there. So yeah, the car park, it's about pound, pound fifty for up to an hour. The original High Street sign, bet that goes back many years. Nice. For wee shoe shops. Lossy Bind. So again, you just go down there, turn right, and there's car parking. That's where I'm parked just now. So I hope you've enjoyed a wee walk up the high street in Elgin, maybe a wee trip down memory lane. For some of you who've stayed here many, many years ago. And if you just enjoy Scotland and seeing all the different places, I hope you've enjoyed it as well. Alteration shop, dresses and stuff like that. If you're looking for new videos from Scotland, as I say, don't forget to subscribe. We've got videos all over Scotland. The Highlands, Loch Lomond, Glasgow, Edinburgh, Ayrshire. Something for everybody. The Muckle Cross. Let me know if you've been in there. A beer garden at the back as well, I believe. 
couple more wee shops down here as well. As I said, if you like to support the channel, it's absolutely free. Give it a wee thumbs up. Hit the like button on YouTube. See how it's push it out. Council headquarters there. The Ionic Bar. Looks like what we class as an old man's pub in Scotland. Probably get some character in there as well. These buildings are nice here down the bottom of the high street. Maybe some office buildings here as well. Got a place there doing eyebrows, the last lounge. Sheriff Court here. Probably go there to fight any parking tickets you'll get in Elgin. These are business gateway and there's some office buildings down here as well, council headquarters. Some really nice buildings down here actually. So I hope you've enjoyed the wee walk down the high street. Well, that's the X Services Club there. And they've probably got the nicest building in the high street. Quite a few services up here because we're quite close to RAF Lossiemouth. So a lot of servicemen came here years and years ago. Some some liked it and stayed. And others are just based up here and they maybe buy a house or rent a house. Plenty of car parking at the end here as well. The Elgin Museum. It's a wee building, nice. Let me know in the comments, maybe you're ex-military, maybe you've served at RAF Lossiemouth and you know Elgin well. A lot of the servicemen stay in Lossiemouth or they stay in Elgin. We've got the copy shop. That's a printing shop, actually. To me it looks like a pub. <laughs> I'm expecting a pint of tent flagging in there. I think we've got a fitness centre here that used to be a trophy centre. Maybe they still sell trophies as well, I'm not sure. And just at the very end, we've got a wee bed and breakfast. If you're staying in Elgin and you want a central location, a couple of wee bed and breakfasts here are perfect. I think we've covered it all. Now, there's something you don't see normally, a bed and breakfast. And they've got wee bikes for sale outside. How unusual. I wonder how much they're selling them for. That's a Belleville. If you're looking it up on TripAdvisor or Booking.com or something like that. That's a Belleville. So I hope you've enjoyed the wee walk. That's us really at the end of the high street. Thanks again so much for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Car, car stopped, you can cross. Okay.
Alright, stay there then. The car's going. That's it, Pat. That's it, past you now. Yeah, it's away. Hello, Mrs. Hello, how are you? Glad to meet you here. I'm just on time, sorry. That's okay,